hi welcome back to Rebecca's Travels or if you're watching my lifestyle channel welcome back to Rebecca's Lifestyle today I'm going to be doing the latest travel news worldwide part 3 travel vlog this week and let's jump right into it but uh, just before we jump right into it um, please subscribe to my channel um, my lifestyle or my travel channel or both um, it's the red and white subscribe button if you also click the notification bell I upload on my uh, travel channel at least three to four times a week and on my lifestyle channel about four times a week as well um, at the moment I'm just uh, doing travel at the moment uh, because I can't think of any lifestyle videos that um, I uh, want to do at the moment <laughs> just say um, so let's get right into it now according to breakingtravelnews.com the five well ten fantastic points um that i think um people should know about um in regards to travel around the world so let's jump to it now number one is global border are slowly reopening the UNWTO research reveals according to the latest analysis from the United Nations World Tourism Organization some 40% of destinations worldwide have now eased restrictions they paved on international tourism response to the outbreak so that's um, again really good news um, especially for people that uh, want to travel abroad so uh, yay <laughs> uh, great news and hopefully the other countries will get back up as soon and as safe as possible number two unfortunately TUI um, are to close 166 retail locations across the UK TUI has announced it will close 100 and 66 stores across the UK and Northern Ireland in what will be seen as a major blow this is again really disappointing to the tourism industry the travel giant said it had accelerated the closures as a result of the coronavirus pandemic um, this again is very unfortunate um, but I hope in time they can reopen the stores uh, fingers crossed touch wood in the future the CAA finds airline improving uh, or airlines in general are improving on refunds which is fantastic news but uh, more work does need to be done the UK Civil Aviation Authority has refunded airlines have upped their game when it comes to providing refunds to the wake of the corona 19 outfits outbreak so yes it is getting better for people out there according to Hayes Travel where I booked um my holiday um in april um they said that it's going to be with me by uh on monday so 
fingers crossed next Monday I should receive the refund if not then I'll have to go in Tuesday again like I did today and have to try and sort something out again but refunds are getting better so which is a good news number four traveling public calls for effective testing regrime which is again for safety purposes um airbus corps a350 production as revenue slumps so it's really unfortunate um and i hope the airbus will be able to get their planes back up and running again as soon as safely as possible and tourists do get to travel again when it's safe to do uh, uh, do so uh, number six andrea maya in the chelsea Chel Seychelles, excuse my pronunciation, Volupius, to open September this year. Wow, that's amazing. I really hope it goes as safely as possible and tourists do return to the Seychelles. So that's exciting news. Yay to that. Also, Anatio is lead Sengita Volcanoes National Park in Rwanda so uh, hopefully Taurus will go there and he does a, fa a fantastic job fingers crossed also num point number eight Fred Olsen launches the first 2023 more uh, North America cruise that's excellent news and good luck uh, to Fred Alston for that um, fingers crossed it goes uh, perfectly or as perfectly as possible number nine Pittsburgh Airport um, rails out UV cleansing robots again very good idea So that, that's again excellent news that the robots will be able to again clean the airport and uh, make it safe or safer just say. Number 10 Virgin Gal Gal Galantic reveals VA SS Uni Unity Cabin Design. It looks absolutely fantastic on breakingtravelnews.com, uh, which is where again I found all these fa fantastic travel points. So I would like to say thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe if you haven't already done so. And I'll see you in my next travel video and lifestyle video which is going to be this sunday at 8 pm because i've got to go to work unfortunately in the daytime so fortunately unfortunately i won't be able to talk to you guys but i will and um it'll be on there by eight o'clock on sunday I love speaking to you guys about travel and lifestyle so uh, and it is just a passion for me so thank you for watching please stay safe and I'll see you on Sunday for travel updates on my channel so I'm going to be telling you the schedule for the following week and thank you and bye for now. Thank you. Bye. Love you all. Bye.